His supporters had demanded his freedom since he was detained last year. Luis Ignacio Lula da Silva, or simply Lula, left prison on Friday surrounded by hundreds of his supporters. You have no idea of the significance for me to be here with you. I, who my whole life talked with the Brazilian people, never thought that today I could be here talking with men and women who during the past 580 days were here saying good morning Lula, good afternoon Lula, and yelling good night Lula no matter if it were raining, if it were 40 degrees or zero degrees. On Thursday, the Supreme Court voted to reinterpret a law that meant anyone convicted of a crime was jailed after losing their first appeal. The ruling allows Lula and more than 4,000 others to exhaust all their appeal options before being locked up. Lula was convicted last year of taking bribes in exchange for public works contracts. It was part of the so-called car wash corruption investigation that saw dozens of politicians and businessmen detained for their role in cases that involved bribes and kickbacks from Brazil's private and state companies. Lula da Silva left office saying that he's ready to fight against what he says is the persecution of the left under the presidency of Jair Bolsonaro. It's not clear yet how he's going to do that. He wouldn't be able to run for office right now because of what is known here as the clean slate law that bans politicians who have been convicted for corruption. Lula has always denied those charges, saying he was a victim of political persecution. The judge involved was Sergio Moro, who is now Jair Bolsonaro's Minister of Justice. His impartiality has been questioned by Lula's Workers' Party. The car wash corruption operation is the largest in Brazil's history and polarized society. Thousands demanded justice on the streets because the investigation discredited Brazil's political class. Discontent paved the way for the election of Jair Bolsonaro as president. And that's why not everyone in Brazil celebrated Lula's release on Friday. I am extremely disappointed because there is no reason in the world a people that can make a criminal, he's a criminal, and make a serious damage for the country. And there is right now a movement and congressmen that will change the situation to allow the prison in the second instance. But in the meantime, Lula is free. And instead of being weakened by his time in prison, he seems determined to reclaim his place in Brazilian politics once again. Teresa Bo, Al Jazeera, Sao Paulo.